Okay, what is up guys? This is Do You Wanna Build a Brony here, and I am ready to continue my trek of Phoenix Wright and MLP crossover turnabout storm. Now, um, if you notice, you, I got like these bar things here. I'm trying to test out and see if it's the resolution, uh, not the resolution, the video input size that that makes it so that it only has the audio when I try to edit in the video because the the lower the the, the frame is uh, the likelihood that 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 my that my audio can stay with my body during recording and it won't have to cut off the video entirely <clears throat> so now where am I okay when we last left off we were in Twilight side of the story and we learn that cruise control is a very liable suspect along with this Lenore, Lenora, Lenora, no, starts with an L, it's a griffin, they're probably the two people who did it, but there's a high possibility that they aren't. Why? Because just for some reason, they look way too good to just kill a guy. Um, uh, who I think it is, I have no idea. So maybe we might get more suspects and more people to look at to see who, who probably did it in Phoenix Wright's side of the story. And from what I already saw in Twilight's, Phoenix Wright is going to be meeting Pinky, and Pinky's going to call him Feeny, and Phoenix Wright is going to have a little bit of a flashback moment. If that happens, you, you can just, it, and if it has, if I still have like face cam, you're going to see me have the dumbest looking face on me, okay? Probably like the dumbest. Maybe. <laughs> but anyway, let's just get started. Let's do this in three, two, one. Now. And I'm sorry to those if my name is Phoenix Wright and I'm fine. Because my name is Phoenix Wright and I'm fine. My name is Phoenix Wright and I'm fine. My name is Phoenix Wright and I'm fine. Phoenix, are you okay? Oh, oh hey, Chief. So this I is was just practicing one. for my very first trial, which is tomorrow. So this is before the guys back at law school terms. said this tape would really help me out. Ah, oh, thank goodness. When I heard all the screeching coming from the office, I thought someone was murdering you. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't screeching, that was step four. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you Scream need this loud. exercise tape. I'm sure you'll do just fine. The suspect, he's your friend, right? Oh, yeah, he's the, my uh, friend, but... But what? He's, well... An idiot. Yes? He's kind of an idiot. Uh, that's not a very nice thing to say about your friend. It's always the buts. No, I really mean it. He thinks passing the 8th grade is a credential. He even got the report card framed and everything. Hey, you don't so, do that? what are you getting at? I mean, what if he really did kill that woman? Come on, Tia, What do I do? Way. Do I still lie and try to defend them? Or do I side with justice and let him be punished? Side with Phoenix. justice. But you have to be trustworthy. Don't stress yourself out so much. Tell me, what do you think? Me? What do you mean? You, as Phoenix Wright, not as a defense attorney. Do you think your friend killed that woman? He might not be the sharpest tool in the shed, <laughs> but I don't think he has it in him to kill anyone. The there you go. <laughs> Huh? Go off that. Ways. You have to believe in him. It's your job to. Cast all that doubt aside and pursue that truth. If you do that, nothing can stop you. The truth, huh? Thanks, Chief. I'm still a little nervous, though. Don't worry. We all go through it. Hey, um, do you by any chance know who the prosecutor is? The prosecutor? Well, you see, it's I believe it's guy Winston Payne. He you know, had hair. the rookie killer. Even though he never beat a rookie, rookie killer. Life. Even though he I don't never like beat a rookie that in title. Not many rookies take the prosecutor into consideration. Why did you want to know something like that? Well, at least what uh, the rookie's eye no reason. I was just curious. You lost. seem more disappointed than curious. <laughs> ah, forget about it. I'm just a little out of it right now. Just a little. Ah, Mia, I miss you so much. I'll never forget what you taught me, but somehow, sorry, I highly doubt you're looking down on me, smiling after what I did today. She understands. Maybe, probably not. No, she hates you. <laughs> Phoenix.
I was wrong about you. Twilight, wait, I... She's gone. Yeah. Who am I kidding? She's right. I did absolutely terrible in there. Now two of her friends are suspects. What do I do now? I don't have any leads at all. You see Nobody to turn to. I'm all by myself. Which means I can't even one. get back home. No, you don't. No. I can't think that way. Never. I've got to stay diligent. I said I'd clear Rainbow Dash's name. And I bought her another day. I can't let it go to waste. There you but go, Phoenix. Think where do I way. start? Hey, Mr. Brandy Rowney. Pinky. What's the matter? <laughs> huh? Where did she come from? She smells like cotton candy. Awesome! Cotton candy? Oh, you must smell the new shampoo I'm using. Ah, that explains it. My... <laughs> Wait, did I just say that or think that... Who are you? Pinky. I'm Pinkie Pie, of course. Pink Amina, Diane Pie. But I can't talk right now. I'm looking for something. <laughs> what for? It's probably that stick. Some other pony said there was a spiky-headed monster mean... in here. I can't seem to find it anywhere, though. I mean, dog I think it'd stick out like a sore hoof. Have you seen it? <sighs> Does that mean... no? Oh, I'm getting so sick of this place! <laughs> hey! Turn oh, that frowny upside down! Made fun of How Sarah can I? I get it. I did such a lousy job in court today. And Twilight probably hates my guts for what I did. More hey, you know Twilight? Me too! You know Twilight Sparkle? Yep, Twilight the Sprinkle. bestest of best friends. Oh, that reminds me! I'm supposed to go to court today and cheer for Rainbow Dash! Sorry, gotta run! But you're... You're kind of late for that, thank you. I'm already here! Yes. Yay! I hate to break it to you, but you missed the trial. Mm -hmm. Out of all the pastel grass chewers I've met, this one is definitely the weirdest. Well, you just automatically yeah. assume they chew grass. You better be careful. I think she can read minds. More is than that, man. Okay? For the time being, yes. The trial is being postponed. I'm actually Rainbow Dash's lawyer. Phoenix Wright. Ooh, Ace Attorney. Neato. Justice for all. So, what you doing right now, Feeny? <sighs> Feeny? That's... <sighs> Never mind. Well, I don't know what I should be doing right now, this to close. be honest. This close for a flashback. I have no leads at all. Why don't you go talk to Dashy about the trial? Wait a minute. She had Cyclox. Cyclox? Is that some kind of breakfast cereal? I wish. Sounds yummy. Is I it wish. made with real locks and not grossly grossly artificial locks? <laughs> Thanks what? for the advice, <laughs> um, <laughs> Pinkie Pie. <laughs> I'm going to go to the detention Perfect center now. Perfect face. Perfect face. Okay, so we got so we got a reaction and not a flashback, but okay. I really hope she isn't mad no at funny me after what you guys are... Oh, no, 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 no! R Rainbow Dash? I, I can't bear to live anymore. Throw the book at me. L let them send me to the sun. There's nothing left for me in Equestria. What happened to the moon? Rainbow well, Dash, get a hold of yourself. The moon or the sun. She must still be upset over those uh, pictures. Easy for you to say. Just now the embarrassing will pictures never of her at the Christmas party. Ponyville is gonna laugh at me forever. <laughs> they were that um bad, <laughs> really. I'm sure everyone will forget by tomorrow. Like, I guarantee it. There's no, no way, way anyone's forgetting images like those. <laughs> you think so? Oh, did yeah. I know so. <laughs> I'm always right. My name is Phoenix Wright, after all. That wasn't funny. No, yeah. it never I was, it was. And never will. Thanks for trying to cheer me up, though. I appreciate it. You're welcome. By the way... Yes? What is it? What was that terrible bad performance in the court today? I could have done a better job defending myself! No, you couldn't. I... I know you couldn't. I know you were Every able to defense that. attorney must suck horse apples if you're supposed to be the best one. Look, I know I screwed up. But I'm gonna make it up to you and Fluttershy tomorrow. Fluttershy? <laughs> she got what she deserved after she betrayed me like that. What? Hey, it tore me up having to do that. It was the only way I could save you. Fluttershy didn't betray you. Give me a break. This is the thanks I get for all the times I stuck up for her sorry flank. Loyalty. She was just telling the truth. Truth? You proved she was lying, though. She didn't see Apple Bloom. Yeah. But she did see you leave the forest. Ooh. You were there, weren't you? 
Whatever. We are ex-friends as of now. Loyalty. I can tell you were trying your hardest. Stay to loyal to your friends. Even Never leave them behind. Ex-friends. Why not? Gee, thanks. Grandma Dash, why do you continue? She pretty much said, yes, just... Rainbow Dash did it. What kind of a friend does that? Can they do that in the show? Rainbow Dash, for awesome. the last time, she was telling the truth. What she saw. <laughs> Actually, that brings me to why I'm here. What? Why are you here? The truth. I want to know what you were really doing near the Everfree Forest the night of the murder. Take that! Yeah. So Ugh, I told you already. Let, I was let's practicing see how a pro for the race. Do it. <sighs> it still works after that incident this morning. Yeah. Huh? What the? Is the guy sure I was what supposed was to see Twilight's anyway? version first? Because this looks more of what I should have Forget seen about first. that. It Whatever. still works and that's all that matters. Okay, there they are. Time to break them. Sorry, but I don't believe you, my little pony. Not for a single solitary second. You're my lawyer and you don't believe me? That's reassuring. Let's play a game, Rainbow Dash. I'm gonna guess what you were really doing near the crime scene that night, and you're gonna tell me if I'm right. Nice game. You can go right ahead and do that, but I'm sticking to my story. I don't think you were practicing at all. I think you were doing something far more important. L like what? Like, oh, I don't know. Meeting someone? <laughs> Meeting some pony? Uh, 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 I mean, who would I be meeting in the middle of the forest at that hour? No pony ever goes in there willingly. Then Except why were you practicing everyone. there if no one ever goes in there willingly? Uh, uh, well... I know there was someone in the forest the night of the murder. Put your money where your mouth is. Who do you think I was meeting? Take that! Ace Swift. The fact your feathers were found all around the clearing proves you were there that night. <laughs> and who else was in the clearing that night? The victim, of course. You needed to be there to see him. You also just told me ponies avoid going in there. So I'm willing to bet he wanted to meet with you in private. And what better place to pick than the middle of a forest nobody ever goes into? <laughs> ah, no! That's one guy. Uh, I mean, ah, uh, no, if it's one you're thing wrong. I love about, you know, the Cyclops and just Why the would game I overall. Meet him? It's how you I physically hurt the person with doing. words. That's like just what? Love it. I don't know, napping? Something like that? Oh, please. Maybe he had something you wanted. You know, like what pictures? I'm saying, maybe he had something important to you. Something you'd move heaven and earth for. I'm a pretty self-satisfied pony. Oh my I god. I got everything I need. Really? Well, besides fortune and glory, and I don't think he could <laughs> sound like 4chan. What could he possibly have that I 4chan and glory. Want? I'm glad you asked that, Rainbow Dash. <laughs> you are? There's one thing that you absolutely needed that I know he had. I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. The reason you went to go meet him is... Take that! These! Ah! Put those away before some pony sees them! Please! It's like she Even right now, forgot. your anxiety shows you absolutely didn't want these pictures floating out and about. Mm. Yes, 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 you're right! I was meeting him about these! Can you please just put them away? Now! <laughs> one more. This brings us to the money question. Why did he have these pictures? Who knows? He's dead. <laughs> what a bummer. <laughs> Who knows? We'll He's never dead. know. <laughs> yeah, what a bummer. I actually no. think I know why. <laughs> you do? Yes. I can think of one reason why he'd want to meet you over pictures like these. Take that. He was blackmailing you, wasn't he? That's all you need. Blackmail. I did it for you, Phoenix. I'm willing to bet my attorney badge he wanted you to toss the Equestrian 500. Even if it is, girly. I was told of Pony suspecting him of foul play in the wake of all his success. He was probably threatening you to let him win the race. Wow. Hmm? You're really good. Don't you mean awesome? It's true. Ace was trying to force me to drop out of the Equestrian 500. How did it start? I got home two days ago and saw this letter on my doorstep. I'll let your secret out if you don't drop out of the Equestrian 500. Meet in the Everfree Forest Clearing, 8.35 tonight for negotiations. At 
first I didn't know what secret it was talking about, but attached to the message was one of those pictures. About those pictures, <laughs> why are you... Why are you... It's a hobby, all right! I bet you have skeletons in your closet too, Mr. 20-something who plays with toys! Okay, okay, I won't ask about I them. I really want to know what's on those Do you pictures. have any idea Fan how theories, got them, though? Please I have no me. clue. My best guess is that the jerk was stalking me, trying to get dirt on me. Rainbow Dash. Yes, what is it? I want you to know that I trust you. And I'm going to need you to trust me when I ask you these next series of questions. Yes, no side huh? locks included. I know you may be scared this will make you look guilty, but I know you're innocent. Uh, I'm not scared! Why did you move that cloud to the crime scene and set it off? <sighs> but, but, I, I, I didn't... Please, Rainbow Dash, you can trust me. I won't think any differently of you in light of what you tell me. I know you didn't kill him. We're positive of that. Okay. Yeah, I'll you tell didn't know you. you killed him. We would get I black sidewalks. I did move the cloud there, and I did set it off. I just wanted to give him a scare. That's all. A scare? That's in like a prank. So you really did move the cloud over the forest clearing? As soon as I saw the requirements of the blackmail letter, I knew it was Ace, and that all those rumors about him were true. He's a blackmailing cheater. So I set up the cloud over the clearing earlier that day with the intent of declining his little offer. So you weren't going to drop out in spite of him leaking the pictures? No way! I'm not going to let some loser have his way with me, even if it meant those pictures getting out. I have too much That could be gone in so many ways, that. some loser have her way with me. I find that really admirable. I'm just going to shut up now. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> this is also my first year competing in the race. I just reached the required age to participate. I've been way too anxious to just drop out. RBD spells victory! No, you sure you can take 500 miles? Oh, I get it. It's longer than it sounds, you know. But There's some how old is she? along the track set up so the racers can have some R&R, &R, but that's a little problem I keep having. There's no doubt I'm fast, but I tire out along the way. I'm not used to flying that long. I believe you. In races like these, you should pace yourself accordingly. Don't like a certain right the start. purple pony. Save all your energy for the home stretch. Kind of like how I don't present all my evidence right from the start. I'll try to well, keep that in chanting mind. But let's get back on topic, shall we? Here, I'm know. supposed to be your lawyer, not your coach. Right. Anyway, I wasn't planning on killing him, just give him a bit of a startle. You know, just kicking some dirt in his face for messing with me. The cloud shoots a lightning bolt directly under it when activated. I mess around with ponies by scaring them with clouds all the time. This is a but fact. But I got an extra big one in his case, to make the sound as loud as possible. This was an I guess episode. it was a little dangerous getting one that big. <laughs> so it didn't hit him when set it off? She, no, she I made it. sure it wasn't over him. Even though it was really dark outside, like you said in the court today, I could see that the bolt didn't even come close to touching him. When the lightning bolt lit up the area, it made him scream like a little girl and left a really sissy look on his mug. Ah. You should have seen it. It was priceless. Then I just hightailed it out of there as fast as I could. That's probably when Fluttershy saw her. Why didn't you tell anyone about this blackmail earlier? I didn't want any pony to know about the blackmail. Because the photos you know, might get leaked they would out. wonder what he was blackmailing me with. Yeah, I see. Then those pictures would get out. Yep. You believe me, right? He was absolutely fine when I left. I swear. Yes, I believe you. Though more questions arise from this. More questions? How did so... he end up dead directly under the cloud? A third party, maybe. I was trying maybe? desperately to convince the court it was the second bolt that maybe? killed him. Maybe. That would make this all an accident, since you have no control over it. But then we have that lightning doesn't strike the same place twice thing that Trixie was talking about. That was the about. best Trixie impression anyone can it's ever do ever. It's a new type of ever. storm cloud the Pegasi are using to protect ponies from situations like this. <laughs> Since it can't hit in the same place twice, they can just stand under a cloud after the first bolt. So the safest place is under the cloud. That's really something. The weather just works by itself where I live. I kind of wish it worked that way here. I have a lot oh, yeah, more free time forest. on my hoof so I could perfect my sonic ray boom or my fantastic Philly Flash. Are about those two moves, moves or something? No, they're the most powerful From moves I hear, ever. You're also the weather ever. manager. I need some information regarding how the lightning here in Equestria works. First one. What do you need to know? Well, is it true the bolt causes the noise? Yeah, it is. I don't know how it works exactly, but I'm pretty sure when it touches the ground or anything attached to the ground, like, say, a tree, it sends out vibrations which makes the boom. I'm no meteorologist, but I'm pretty sure lightning doesn't work like that. Now, maybe in your world. Again, I keep forgetting I'm in a land full of magical talking ponies who can manually change weather. Is there anything that can prevent <laughs> it from awesome, making huh? a sound? 
I suppose if it hit something small in the air that was close enough to the cloud, yeah, it wouldn't make a sound, and I know what you're thinking, but that couldn't happen. Why not? That itchy racing suit. Oh, right. I remember that being brought up. That's that oh, right. lightning-proof suit that you Pegasuses wear for the race, right? Pegasi. The plural is Pegasi. I, I absolutely that. hate wearing that thing, but while in the air, you're pretty much invulnerable to lightning. It Weren't there some exposed parts on it, though? You know, like the wings yes, and mouth are. and uh, But while you're in the neck. flying position, those parts are covered up. They're only exposed when you're on all fours and grounded. This is sounding more and more hopeless for on me to talk fours. about it. Try to cheer up. I'll find out what really happened and get you out of here. Thank you, Nix. Okay, Rainbow Dash. Yeah, I forgot. That's I'm gonna go do some her. more investigating in light of this them. new information. Alright, catch you later. Oh, wait, one more thing. Yes? Pinkie Pie. Nah. I bumped into her after the trial. I'm guessing she's a friend of yours. Yes. She wanted to cheer you on in court today, but sadly, it seems she was late. Uh, is she always that, uh, loopy? Pinkie Pie being Pinkie Pie. <laughs> yeah, that's just Pinkie Pie being Pinkie Pie. <laughs> okay, yeah. just thought I'd let you know. Well, goodbye, Rainbow Dash. Don't question her. Wait! Jeez, I just can't leave this place. No, you can't. Yes? What Never. is it? Here, take this. A key? What is it for? <laughs> Ace's hotel room. Oh, I what? Was about to say. How did you get this? You know. I was angry when I thought he was stalking me, so I snuck into his hotel room to find dirt on him. It was under the mat. What a stupid place to leave your key, huh? Uh, yeah, stupid place. Yeah, idiotic. <laughs> Put key to office in different hiding spot. I wasn't able to find anything good in there, but maybe you can. Where's the hotel? He was staying in the Hay and Stay Hotel while he was in Ponyville. It's a little past Sugar Cube Corner. Just have Twilight show you where it is. Twilight. Yeah. What's the about matter? That. Uh, oh, nothing. Thanks, Rainbow Dash. This will really help my investigation. Goodbye, Nix. I promise I'll get you and Fluttershy out of this mess. <laughs> Fluttershy. Loyalty. I told you, I don't care about her. Loyalty. She's still really angry about that testimony Fluttershy gave. Loyalty. I just know you'll find some super awesome evidence this time around. And don't even give me no rep. Loyalty means you stand by your friends no matter what they do. That's not standing by your friends no matter okay. what they do. Where should I go first? Back to the forest or to the hotel room? I think it would be a lot easier to go to the forest, since I know the general direction, and I might find some new clues with the sun out. Hello? Are you ignoring Pinky? And then again, Who do I already you found a lot of are? evidence in the forest already. Knock knock, Feeny! Though, uh, would going I, I in this hotel the room Feeny be considered breaking and entering? Yes, actually. I'll have a bit of trouble finding it without someone guiding me anyway. Uh, well, I've yeah. got your attention now. <laughs> oh! You're Pinkie Pie. I think, I think it's me. one of the names that he what did are you doing wrong. Here? I followed you. The guards won't let me in, though, so I just talked with them while I waited for you. Right, boys? Oh, for the love <laughs> of all things holy, please take her away. <laughs> uh, why were you following Four guards. Because I need help finding something. Look, the, the spiky-headed monster they were talking club. about is... Oh, I gave up trying to find that a long time ago. It's probably just some pony's overactive imagination. Oh. I need to find something I lost about a week ago. What did you lose? It's a secret. It's a golf club. So, you want me to help you find something, but you won't tell me what it is? Correct the moon, though. <laughs> that makes no sense! I'm serious. Maybe I should have watched this one first, because there's a lot of stuff. But... Actually, uh, Pinkie Pie... Whatever. Yes? I, I, Do you I know where Sugar anybody. Cube Corner is? Ooh! You want to go bake cupcakes with me at Sugar Cube Corner? It's her house slash job. Always let me help out. Now I have an assistant. Yay! You know how to make cupcakes, right? It's okay if you can't. I can teach you if you don't know. It's really, really, really easy. Yeah, really Let's easy. Just don't eat one. one. Put the liners in your flour, and everything powder and salt in the mixing bowl. A shortening milk, 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 flavor, and taste. I personally put a little bit of milk in the mixing bowl. For one minute, let's rip the stuff in the We want to salvage as many as we can from the mix. Was that like an abbreviation of the entire I song? <laughs> I was wondering if you knew oh, where the hand stays. Really how you make it's a hotel? I heard it was by there. I didn't hear Rainbow Dash. Of course I know how to make cupcakes. <laughs> what does she think I am, a hobo? Yes, yes. Me. I know where it is. I need someone to escort me. Would you be willing to do that for me? 
If I help you find your missing... Uh, thing? <laughs> thing. Okie dokie dokie, on one other condition. What's up? Name it! This is gonna be easier than I thought. You have to tell me a funny joke! Oh, you're doomed. What? what? You can't think of Why a joke Why do I to have to do life. that? I don't want to hang out with some big party pooper frowny stick in the mud. So we have a sense of humor, Feeny. Detective Gumchew do and Edward really have, to have do a lot this? more mm -hmm. jokes better than you, okay? Well, it seems really easy to impress anyway. Okay, this is a really good one, Pinkie Pie. You're gonna do it, isn't Tell you? me, tell me! He's gonna do it. Here goes. Why do they call me Phoenix Wright? Mm, I don't know. Why? Because I'm always right! As expected. That wasn't funny. It's as expected. That so, was do you have any better ones? <gasps> well, oh. uh. This one time I cross examined a parakeet. What's the deal with that? Hey, come on, that was actually pretty fun to do. <laughs> this is a lot harder than I thought. I'm a lawyer, not a comedian. Well, you did have funny um, moments. Did you know I had the entire left side of my body cut off once? Don't worry, I'm all right now. <laughs> okay, that was actually kind of funny. Kinda. Uh, oh, hey, what's that? <laughs> this? It's my equestria attorney badge. And that's how I got in that detention center. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow! That is the girliest thing I've ever seen! Wow. That must have been why you were pretending to be so bad at telling a good joke! To build up to flashing that ridiculous looking thing! <laughs> oh, you sure are a knee slapper, Feeny! Oh, well, that happened. <laughs> I really feel like sobbing to myself in a dark corner right now. I have one so, waiting right there, buddy. So, will you show me where this hotel is now? <laughs> uh, Pinky? Oh, oh, right! The hotel is this way! <laughs> hey! <laughs> wait up! Alright, we're getting some. Phoenix Wright fans know what that is. Hmm. Okay. Do you think Don't mess with that trouble phone. For going in this room with Have it on my phone. Don't be such a chicken, Feeny. Give me that uh, Hey! We can't just... We just stick in here and... We're in! Pinkie Pie, Master of Unlocking! Unlocking. I really hope I don't get sent to the sun for this. So, this no is No one likes room. the moon anymore, I guess. Feeny okay. he's dead. Surely he won't mind if we look around. My name is Pinky, not Shirley. Yeah. What are we trying to find here anyway, Pinky? A magical stone? A secret chamber? A prisoner? A cup? Maybe something you ordered? Oatmeal? Oatmeal? oatmeal. And I was like, oatmeal? Why would are you crazy? Want to find oatmeal? Duh! When they're hungry. <sighs> See, she has a point. No, Pinkie Pie. We're trying to find clues that relate to the crime. So, no oatmeal? No oatmeal. No oatmeal. Aww. I want to try and be out of here as fast Stop. as humanly possible, okay? Stop! I don't want to be caught by anyone. Stop! Alright! Okay. I'll try to be as fast as poonily possible then. <sighs> Maybe it was a mistake taking her in here with me. Maybe a bit. Look, Feeny! A step ladder! Is that a clue? One. Conflict. That's not a clue. Conflict. Two. That's not a step ladder. <laughs> it's a ladder. There's a difference? Yes! There's a big difference. Uh. A step ladder has an A-frame that folds. Well, a ladder is flat like that one. I still don't see what the difference is. I mean, you still step on it, right? Wouldn't it be a step ladder then? <laughs> That's right. <sighs> That's How right. It's not a Phoenix Wright game unless you have that conflict. It's like cupcakes <laughs> and muffins. Cupcakes and muffins? Exactly. Both look kind of the same, but they're totally different. Like ladders and step ladders. Yeah, cupcakes, cupcakes have frosting yeah. on them. Like how step ladders have a folding frame. Cupcakes well, are good for parties. Muffins are usually plain. Muffins like are plain. Like ladders flat. Oh, Cupcakes are not, like, good now? for, like... Like hacksaws and saws? Why'd they call it a hacksaw, anyway? I don't get it. It doesn't hack. Hacking is what you do with daggers and axes. And knives! Uh... Yeah... Okay, seriously, she's freaking me out now. But you sure know a lot about ladders, Feeny. Are you sure you're a lawyer and not actually a ladder connoisseur? It's just common sense. 
I'm having I some thoughts that, that maybe a, a certain Pinkie Pie is them. actually the murderer in the Wait a minute. I'm just Wasn't the victim out there. of Pegasus? Why would he need a ladder anyway? He could just fly up and get the things he would need a ladder for. <laughs> maybe he was superstitious and didn't want bad luck. Keeping a ladder doesn't prevent bad luck. You get bad luck for walking under a ladder. What about this? Is ripped up paper good luck? Shouldn't it be a step it's ladder? A piece of ripped up paper. Why would it be good luck? I need an aspirin. Yes, <laughs> you're right. It just has a bunch of mumbo jumbo on it anyway. Mumbo jumbo? Well, let me see it. This is a letter stating my permanent leave of absence. After the Equestrian 500 is over, I can no longer work with you. We made quite the team, but I... And then it cuts off. The rest must be on the other half. Jinkies, Jinkies. we found a clue. You found a clue! Yeah. Is that good luck? Yes. No. No. Well, well yes. No. Kinda. Good job, Pinky. Yeah. Yay! Thumbs up. <laughs> High five. Hi, Hoof. Brofus. It would only make sense if Hoof wrote this, <laughs> since it's his room. But who was he writing it to? Maybe he... Oh, no! <laughs> what? Shh. We aren't supposed to be in here, remember? What's the problem? So, my tail's twitching! Someone's about to fall. So, my foot fell asleep, you don't see me freaking out. Why is she hiding under that table? Pinkie Pie, stop fooling around and- <laughs> OW! <laughs> see? I warned you! What? I didn't say anything was gonna fall on my head! <laughs> sure I did! I said my tail was twitching! That means something's gonna It'll fall! fall. That's ridiculous! <laughs> you can't tell me you can make predictions like that based on body spasms! Oh, look out! We so got another awesome. Twilight here! <laughs> you mean the thing that fell on my head? It seems like it's some sort of advanced spell book. Advanced. Hey, Dee! Do you think that you can cast a spell? I can't since I'm an Earth pony. What is this of Pegasus course doing not. With a spell book? I'm not a magician! I can't even read it anyway! I only know it's an advanced spell book because I saw Twilight reading a book just like it this morning. And I asked her what it was. Hmm. The text isn't in English. The characters are in weird hieroglyphics like Twilight's book. Huh? Look at this. Continue from here. Third line. Seems someone scribbled a note here. You can get in big trouble for writing in a hotel's book like that! No, I don't think this is the hotel's book. Twilight said these advanced spell books are only available in ca... Canterlot. In... Eh, I forget the name. Starts with a hard C, if I recall. Canterlot. Cookie? Cookie. No. Carrot? Carrot. No. Corkscrew? No. Just stop guessing. Corkscrew. The point is, this must be someone's personal book. Caterpillar? Caterpie? Cantaloupe? I'd better put it back on the shelf. It was all the way up there. I can reach it. Oh, because he's so tired. Got it! Ah! No! Benny! Didn't you just told me to be quiet a second ago? Practice what you preach! I ripped my suit! Oh, that's You're worse. You're right! You have a big <laughs> hole in your armpit! Should have used the step ladder instead of reaching so high. There you go. It's a ladder! It's a ladder. You don't realize how bad this is! I can't walk around with a big rip in my suit! No use crying over spilt milk. The core ripped armpits. <laughs> Looky! It's Rainbow Dash! <laughs> Huh? Where? That suit to feature right is like it's, it's pride, is joy, pride well, and joy. it's okay. her name, all right. What is this? Lenora, like that's some her kind name. of list. Maybe it's a party invite! Yes. Do you know who these other names are, Pinky? Nope. Doesn't ring any bells. I want to know still the only name on here I recognize. I want to know Alucard's uh -oh. story. I Tell me what Alucard's the story is. It's right are. there. It's right under Why? Lori Wade. I throw a party for every new pony in Ponyville. <laughs> That reminds me! I haven't thrown a welcome party for you yet! That's I'm true. sorry, Feeny, I just haven't had the time today! Uh, that's alright. <laughs> you seem so upset about it. Really? Look next to Rainbow Dash's name. It's a time. 8.35. I yeah, was right! It's a party invite! Rainbow Dash party at 8.35. I'll try not to be late this time. I don't think so. I think I know what this is now. Danger zone! <laughs> I just know this danger zone. As soon no. as they cut it off. Tell me! Tell me! I'm not completely positive, but I think this is a- And just who are you two? Mm. Oh no, we're caught! Why are you snooping around my room? Why are <gasps> you here? Ch Chief! Chief? I should have the police book you two and have you thrown in jail for breaking and entering. Hi, uh, Mia, for I... some reason. This can't be Mia. It just can't be! Yeah. We're room service. Apparently it is. <gasps>
Do you honestly think she's going to fall for that? Yes. Do you honestly think I'm going to fall for... Yes. Wait a minute. <laughs> I know who you are. It's me, Mia. Mia? My name is Sonata. Eh? Sonata? Did I stutter? Yes, yeah. that's oh, my name. Oh, that one chick from the... Uh, it's not her. The first two seconds. But the resemblance. It's uncanny. Except for the name. glasses. Now. Phoenix Wright. Pink Mina Diane Pai. Party throw extraordinaire. As I thought. You're that human lawyer from the trial earlier. I can't get over this. It looks exactly like her. Except for the glasses. Or a pony. Can you stop staring at me like that, please? What's the matter, Phoenix? I said that already. That, I mean, like... That would hurt. Yeah, if only he said if it wasn't for the glasses, she'd be a spitting image. Really Ouch! Are you okay? I knew Rainbow Dash was guilty, but it didn't even look like you were trying in court today. You were there? Who exactly are you? She said she's Sonata. I'm the one who should be asking questions here. Seeing as you two are the ones who broke into my room, I'm betting you're the one who stole the key two days ago. But isn't this a Swift's room? Yeah, what is a unicorn doing with a... You're here about him? A ladder. <laughs> I see. We were just investigating his hotel room for clues. This is his room, is it not? Hmm? Oh, yes. That is correct. You just said this was your room, though. What are you, his girlfriend or something? That's strike one, Mr. Wright. I suggest you not strike out anymore. You don't, yeah. like, just uh, openly out. out. You just don't open out with that. Uh, you? you just sorry. say, you say you're Actually, friends with I'm... him first. Or should I say was his manager, given the circumstances? His manager? Okay, I'm trying to piece some things together. Oh, she reminds me of her more than weird. more than Mia. I have to say I'm that. Sorry about what happened. She reminds me a lot more Don't than worry, her. I got over it. With the glasses. Besides, justice will be served. The only thing is Your wrong with the be pair. For her crime. Hey, Rainbow Dash didn't do it. Any pony with half a brain can see that she did it, Mr. Wright. Look at all the evidence stacked against her. No matter how you look at it, she was the one who activated that cloud and killed him. Someone's Your in, little uh, feather theory little may have bought some time, but she's going to be found this, guilty huh? tomorrow morning. I mean, like, I you don't even know her. I believe Why are you her, just and I'm immediately the shifting to blame? The very end, mm -hmm. No matter what you say. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's why you're going to lose. From what I've gathered, you're not even from Equestria. Why place loyalty in a pony you hardly know? Because Did you have to I defend the element of loyalty I said, by being loyal. Because I believe her. She didn't do it. Arrogant. Just like that prosecutor. I say persistent. Do you mean Trixie? <laughs> yes, her. What do you have against her? I wish to prosecute for this case, but that pig headed showmare beat me to it. Really? She does seem a lot more qualified to be a prosecutor than Trixie. Hey, and I think it would be so rather wait, interesting for you. You're to a prosecutor face up as well as a manager. She reminds it's me of Blackwell. I'm from Canterlot, Equestria's capital. Most of the unicorns there are jacks of all trades, so to speak. <laughs> we take on as many jobs as we can to flourish our intellect and magical abilities. Wow! I didn't even know that. I should take another trade. Maybe bowling? No, creative writing. No, no. How about scuba diving? No. Pinky, it doesn't look like she shares your enthusiasm. She should. She looks so enthusiastic. She's from this Canterlot place then? <laughs> yes, she is. I was in Ponyville when the murder took place, so there wasn't enough time for me to go to Canterlot and execute the procedures to prosecute this case. Trixie must have already been there when she heard about it. How foolish. Taking a case over a silly little garage. Yeah. It's funny, really. Part but of it's a lot deeper than that, apparently. Who has the grudge now? Mm. I actually know quite a bit Ooh, about it. Care to listen? A story! I love stories! I'll tell you the one where me and some kind of blue soup broke into somebody's room and rummaged through their personal belongings! It's a classic. It's almost like you two were there. <laughs> For the love of God, shut up! <laughs> if you wouldn't mind, I wasn't told much about Trixie. I was classmates with her when I was but a foal. Really? I attended the same magic classes as her. Were you friends with her or something? No. Strike two. I kept to myself as I do now. I only consult with those who are worth my time. Hey, you know what that means, Feeny? We're, We're both worth our time. time. <laughs> you thought she wouldn't like us for breaking into her room. 
Every time you speak, you make that glare icier and icier. Continuing. <laughs> You're gonna be the in the Arctic in no time, buddy. The for today is how she has been all her life. An arrogant boaster. A show-off. A boastbuster, you could say. I hate that type. She was at the top of the class. As much as I hate to say it, she's better than me. Ooh. Despite me being older. Ooh. Well, when it comes to magic, anyway. Ah, uh, so you're just jealous then! Hey, Pinky! Is your brain the size of chewed bubblegum? Uh, I did I say her brain's so. about the size of If it were bubblegum, it would probably stick to the inside of my head, don't you think? Ugh! Pinky, this is literal, just stop here. talking, please! That's impossible. I'll stop talking. Ah, uh, oops, sorry, I spoke. Ah, uh, I spoke again! And again! You started and again! You made it, you started it, you made it. <laughs> I think she's uh -huh. adding an aneurysm uh, of okay? pure stupidity. Yes. Excuse me. <laughs> anyway, I'm not jealous. In fact, unlike Trixie, I'm striving to become better with magic, not going around town and showing off a bunch of cheap parlor tricks. You should earn attention and praise for the actions you do, not what you claim you can do. So, just because she showed off in school, you hate her? Sorry, but that's a little shallow, if you ask me. Really, actually. But is it? Do you think she's qualified to be prosecuting? You saw how she acted. She's no rather good at it. No at all. I've had it worse in the courtroom. Toupees, birds, whips. 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 <laughs> uh, don't ask. And now in a new game, she's a sword a done, that's apparently invisible. Wrong with it. <laughs> well, why do you want to prosecute this case so badly anyway? I, I know you were his manager, but still. Because if things were going my way, the case would have been closed by now. Cold, hard, swift justice. Mm. That's the way I work. That's not what being a lawyer is about, Sonata. Then what is it about, Mr. Wright? Sitting back and letting a dangerous felon off the hook, scot-free? Seriously? No. You, it's you, about you look at Ramble Dash and you think, the yeah, she's gonna kill somebody. Attorneys aren't meant to uphold justice. We're to like, work to the best of our abilities to be guide for the and rest seek of out life. the truth. You have quite the ideals, Mr. Wright. I don't know what kinds of trials and tribulations you've been through, but you're not changing my opinion. I found that. Rainbow yeah, Dash I got is that. guilty, trials and, tribulations. and that's all there is One of my favorite it. games, I have to say. If you don't mind me asking, what does that eyeball stand for? It's a cutie mark! It must mean your special talent is poking Pony's eyes out with that horn! <laughs> Then we are so dead. That should be oh. everyone's, what every unicorn's special it? talent, then. Uh, are you okay? <laughs> because they can all you do it. You look like you're in pain. Yes, I'm fine. But no, my talent is perceiving and having a keen eye for detail. Really? For instance, well, my right? mark sense you're desperately for, uh, trying to change very, the very happy. hoping I forget about you breaking into my room, <laughs> indicated by your nervous breathing patterns and the sweat trickling down your forehead and neck. You're also trying to cover up that embarrassing rip in your armpit. I can tell by how firmly your left arm is pressed against your body compared to your right one. Wow, she really is. <laughs> and her, she's... Pinkie Pie. She's thinking about ladders. Step ladders. Wow, how did you know? You must be psychic. But I was actually thinking about step ladders. It's That's right. a ladder! Even I could have gotten that one. <laughs> Throughout the whole conversation, you keep looking at it. <laughs> but... Sonata, can you tell me a little bit more about Ace? What's there to say? He was good at what he did. Good at what he did? Yeah, sure. That creep was blackmailing Rainbow Dash. What about your relationship with him? As his manager, I mean. Well? <laughs> That's none of your business. For a second there, she kind of hesitated. Perhaps I should press this further. I want to know, Sonata. Take that! What was it like being Ace Swiss manager? I told you, Mr. Mm. Wright, it's none of your business. This one's gonna be tough. And Bingo was his name-o. I knew there was more to you than meets the eye. <laughs> get it? Because you're cheetah marks and I? No, <laughs> you excuse me. I have some work to attend to. I would appreciate it if you left my room post-haste. That's odd. Didn't you say she was gonna have us arrested for breaking and entering? I guess you... All right, let's go piqued her by. interest. Yep, yep. I wish you the best of luck on your investigation. You'll need it. Phoenix doesn't need luck. He just needs his epic finger point of justice. I was sweating bullets back there. 
She's quite intimidating for a pony. I didn't find her intimidating. I tried to make her smile. How mm. do you think I did? Uh, you, you succeeded. Don't quit your day job. Okay. Wait, what is my day job anyway? Working at Sugar Cube Corner. It's more of a hobby. Pinky, you still haven't told me. How did you manage to be so late for the trial? I slept in. Because she was off murdering a swift. I'm still thinking of it. Dude. That whole That's axe thing. Ugh. Is something wrong? No, I guess I was just expecting a Look, better I'm reason you, than that. I, I can I see it now. I have a bad habit of being late. That's why I don't plan parties too far in advance. I'll just be late and miss all the fun. So I just throw them whenever I want. This is your singing that says a lot grounds, about you. So I hope it finds you well. I thought you were a bit annoying at first. But I can see now that you're just, uh, a free spirit. Now we have Phoenix Wright being Rainbow, Rainbow Dash. <laughs> you remind me a lot of a girl I know. Aw, thanks, Feeny. So what do you think happened, Pinkie Pie? Hmm? I wonder what the you're talking about. Is it what do you Pearls, think really happened? Or is it Maya? Oh, oh, I think oh, it's Maya I know. that he was hmm? saying. Maybe, just maybe. Because she doesn't have the adopted Rainbow daughter Dash. yet. Dash. Yes? Maybe she has an evil twin sister nobody knows about. Yeah, so there are two Rainbow Dashes. One good, one evil. Double, Double Rain Rainbow Dash? Double Rainbow Dash. Oh, the way! It would be so intense. <laughs> Don't you think someone would notice two Speaking Rainbow of double Rainbow, by now? I have to do double All Rainbow All colors, soon. they'd stick Thank you out. for reminding me, Phoenix An evil right. twin sister nobody knows about doesn't seem plausible. <laughs> no, Phoenix, I think I'm onto something here. We have to find that bad Rainbow before she starts again. Let's call her Wadnyar. 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 <laughs> Wadnyar. But that's just... Rainbow. Ugh. Why am I even arguing about this? Wadnyar. Hey, look there. Huh? Hey, you two. Did you by any chance receive a letter not posted to you? I did. Whoa! Uh, I, 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 uh, eyes. Eyes. <laughs> did Derp? Have you seen the right optometrist eyes. about that? Optometrist? Feeny. Uh oh. Uh, I mean, I, I mean, um, uh, mean no see letter. <laughs> That's just great. What's the matter? Some airhead gave an important letter to the wrong pony, and I'm trying to track it down. Stop looking into those entrancing eyes. Did she Aren't still they, Isn't she adorable? Or maybe she can see through the very fabric of time and space. That would be pretty cool. Hey, I know you. <laughs> Guess my reputation precedes me. Phoenix Wright, so best cool. attorney in the You're universe. that big loser lawyer from Rainbow Dash's trial. Dude. Hey, you're famous, Phoenix. Shots fired. Wish I could have seen you in action. I think the word you're looking for is infamous. <laughs> best game ever. That part where you didn't know Pegasus Second son is like. Clouds? Oh, well, oh, I laughed and laughed. I'm not saying second son is bad. But I wasn't it's laughing. good. It's good. A little Look, short. I it's on the short side. That's the only thing bad. And in case you haven't noticed by me not being a pony, I'm not from around here. Who are you anyway? The name's Derpy Hooves. Ditsy. Oh, that's kind Dip, of a cool Ditsy name. Ditsy do. Ditsy do. Well, and also Bright Eyes. No, stop. Ooh. Uh, uh, give us a second. Pinkie Pie knows what it What's is. What's wrong, Pinkie? Don't say her name. Why not? She's really, 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 really sensitive about it. Don't say her name, whatever you do. <laughs> I think it's kind of a harsh name, but she seems okay with it. Okay. Listen to that upbeat, oblivious voice. Da, 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 da. No, 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 no. <laughs> Just trust me on this one. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fine. I don't see what the big deal is, though. Trust me. Okay, it's better done. if you just right well do what Pinky uh, says. I mean, uh, blonde main pony. Blonde main pony. What did you think of the trial? Blonde main pony. Best name Didn't ever. Did I tell you my name? No. Uh, I. Uh, <laughs> I uh, yes. I. Yes. Me see no letter. Uh. Like your main. Like your main. <laughs> oh really? I did it up all nice this morning. Yeah, it even really though it looks good. almost exactly like hey, Rainbow Dash's I say something about your hair, shape, but it really only all like blonde. You in front of a fan for a long time. <laughs> Is this what I get for trying to be nice? Okay. That was Twilight. I'd like to hear about what you thought of the trial. Fluttershy. Since apparently Rainbow you were there. Dash. <laughs> oh, I was there all right. Pinkie Pie. It was Derpy, oh, Ditsy, hey, Bright I, Eyes. I'll tell you in a poem. I've been told. So many people were making fun of his hair. When reciting mail carrier code. What? Ahem. <clears throat> The defense really seemed out of luck. If you want my opinion, you really did suck. Wow. Mr. Beard was indecisive and fickle. Fluttershy seemed like she is in quite the pickle. Wow. Little Apple Bloom heard that first bolt touch the ground. But why didn't the second one make a sound? Ooh. The prosecution's put-downs were quite rich. But honestly, she was being a big stuck-up meanie. Me. <laughs> oh, that was really good.
Thank you. Meanie. Thank you. I need to take a page from her book when I do my second really wasn't that season. Bad. Uh, I better be off now. Ryan. I'll be in deep doo doo if I don't find that letter. <laughs> Bye. Fuck up. Uh, by the way, I should warn you. Meanie. <laughs> there is a nasty unicorn calling ponies terrible names out and about. Oh, oh so this was after the conversation. Talk. Just thought I'd warn you. See ya. She gave so the letter to Twilight. To yeah, it should come in handy tomorrow. <laughs> oh, an accident. I wonder now. why Shinanda <laughs> didn't have us arrested, though. Maybe she likes you. I yeah. highly doubt that. She was shooting daggers at me with her eyes. I must have been Whose looking the other way when that happened. That must have been so cool. Pony? I wish I could shoot daggers from my eyes. It's a metaphor, Pinky. Again with the whole daggers but it thing. it sort of doesn't look mm -hmm. that way. Just <laughs> look at my suit. You're still upset about that? Yes. Of course I am. This is the only one I have on me. <laughs> I can't walk into court with a ripped suit. I'll look so unprofessional. You could just go naked like me. <laughs> Are you crazy? I'm not going to show up in court naked. Trust me. Why not? Be all right. <laughs> Everybody else does it. Uh, it's... Oh, hey! I know what can fix that for you uh... in a jiffy. <laughs> well, it's better than going in my birthday suit. Uh, who can fix this for me? Rarity can. Rarity? Oh, we get to see I Rarity? I guess we can make a detour to get That'd this be repaired. Awesome. I feel awkward with this hole in my armpit. Carousel Boutique is over yonder, Feeny. Vroom, vroom! <laughs> Carousel hey, Boutique is over yonder. Hey, stop running ahead of me like that! Hmm. So we get to see Rarity. That's great. Wow. This place is really... Posh. Posh. <laughs> Probably reflects the owner's personality. A lot. Oh, visitors. Whoa! A marshmallow, marshmallow pony. pony! What? Oh, it's just you, Pinkie Pie. Marshmallow and... Pony? <laughs> That's me! <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter? That's hair! Six. Go ahead. Just make fun of it. I've actually gotten used to it. Six What's it gonna be? person to make fun of it. Why is there a hedgehog sleeping on your head? Sonic That one's hedgehog. always a classic. Make fun of it? Whatever do you mean? I think it's fabulous! Oh, wow. Huh? Cross that one off. You like it? like it? I love it! It's so dynamic, so intense, so daring! It just screams at me! What's the phrase I'm looking for? Take that? Take that. Take that? Objection! Yes! It screams! Take that! Hold it! I can handle anything you send my way! That's actually the hairstyle I can kind of think of. your hair! I'd like to use this style on some of my customers! I sort of just style it myself in the mirror. Then you have a natural talent for this. That should be his, uh, <laughs> Thanks, you're mark. making me flush. Making him make oh, spiky hair, dude. marvelous royal blue suit of yours! I'm most partial to purple myself, but after setting my eyes on such a sophisticated, elegant suit like this, I might change my mind! Mm. It has so much character in it! It boldly proclaims to the world! Hold oh, it! Help me out here. What's the way Objection? to Objection! Hold it? Yes! Why, yes, that's it! I am a figure of great importance, and you will listen to what I have to say. Wait, what's this? What's wrong? There's a giant hole in your suit! Yep, There's a hole in my shoe. Rarity. This will not do. This will simply not do at all. We can't have you walking around with this gaping hole in your suit. It's a dignified <laughs> spit in the face of fashion. Really? I don't like the hole much either, but it isn't that big. <laughs> No, no, it's positively huge! Give it to you right now! I must fix up your suit! And since you're such a sharp dresser and a fantastic stylist, I'll do it free of charge. Okay, if you're offering. Now, Mr. Feeney, let us talk. I oh, would like to know more Mr. about Feeney. you. Mr. Feeney. I do enjoy some friendly discourse while I'm working. But you're sewing. Don't you need to concentrate? Stitching is second nature to me, and this is such a simple job. Multitasking is my middle name, after all. Trust me, it is. Really? I think his son was Tabitha. Okay, then. Really? That's, my, that's a middle name? don't call me Feeny. One pony Rarity calling Tabitha. me that is more than enough. What shall I call you, then? My name is Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. Oh, I see. So you must be that human attorney Twilight had hired. Yeah, that's me. You have been quite the talk of the town since this morning. I have? Very much so. News around Ponyville travels exceptionally fast, being so small and such. I found around that Twilight had brought you here from a whole other world. Yes. Yeah, that's true. Mm. Oh, how rude of me. I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Rarity, or Miss Rarity, if you prefer. Nice to meet you, Rarity. I have to say, out of all Twilight's friends I've been introduced to, 
You seem the most mature. You don't say! Actually, well, yeah, I, I haven't thought about that that way. Up. Rarity has well, been, like, the most mature, even though she is little. Sure. No offense, Pinkie Pie. Yeah. <laughs> Rarity, on the other hand, conducts herself like a proper lady. But back on the subject of this other world you're from, could you do me a favor, Mr. Wright? What would that be? Other ponies where you come from. Yeah, yes, there are. But they're not talking Excellent. or awesome. <laughs> they actually like to bite you. I want to give you some of my concepts. Your concepts? Horrible, horrible yes, memories. Please, see, Don't want to talk I about I am it. a designer and an entrepreneur of sorts. <coughs> I would like you to give my work to some of the ponies you know and ask for their opinions on them. This could really help me expand my business. Please do tell them to be honest, though. I really need some constructive criticism. Honesty! I'll have a little trouble doing that. They don't talk. <laughs> they don't talk? My word! What a strange world you come from, Mr. Wright. Very strange, no and stupid, and not very None fun. They can fly or use magic? They don't do that either. They just sort of sit in petting zoos and perplex. And they kind of smell. My, no offense. My, my. Perhaps they just need a highly cultured pony from Equestria, such as myself, to teach them some proper etiquette. There's nothing I would want or more than you, Rarity, to be in our world. Yeah, sure. So, uh, if you're I, I bet I know what Twilight you guys are wondering. And Pinkie Pie here, Why am I constantly looking down? Well, you'll see later. Just Why, give yes. it a second. Yes, I am, Mr. Wright. And you're aware of what's happening to her right now? Yes, I am. Don't worry, Rarity. Feeny and I are hot in the trail of Wadney R. Wadnyar! Wadnyar! Yeah! It's Rainbow Dash's evil twin sister that nobody knows about! Rainbow Dash has a twin sister? That nobody told didn't know that. Of course you didn't! Did you catch the no pony knows about part? You're a <laughs> pony and you don't know! See? Pinky, there is no evil twin sister! You don't know that! But, Rarity, what I don't recall seeing you at the trial today. Were you there? I wanted to go to the trial, really I did, but I couldn't make it. Why she had not? more important stuff. Pinkie Pie was late and missed it because she slept in or something. I'm sure you have a better reason. Hey! Hey! You see, I was expecting a package today that I'd been really anxious to get my hooves on. What was it? A shipment of imported perfume. It was supposed to be here on my doorstep this morning. So I went to the post office to ask why it hadn't arrived, expecting to be in and out in two shakes of a lamb's tail. And it didn't go like that, that way, I'm guessing. No. She was the one taking the records back in the first part. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Yes, I got a tad frustrated and lost my composure while waiting in that right. line. Right. Just a tad, though. What I had to do was inquire where my package was. A tad? A tad. It sounds like you had an aneurysm. <laughs> Once you're in that line, there's no going back. It's like they intentionally trap you, forced to endure the tedious, slow-moving line, watching ponies write their life stories with that one pen. Why don't they one stop more pen? pens? But the worst was yet to come. They said they didn't receive my perfume, making my trip all in And pain. that's her perfume. What do you mean by that? It was imported from a Your horrible sea. smelling they perfume. They said the shipment never arrived in Ponyville. That's a shame. Shame? Shame? I wasted an entire hour of my life at wow. the post office. <laughs> that is a perfect that face. It's just betrayal. standing there. Naturally, I complain. I it's so like angry. my life is being ruined them. by no. every second of no, every day of ever my life. <laughs> Are you getting some form of compensation for this? Hell no. No, not at all. At the very least, they said they'd put in another shipment for me. It will take another week to get here, though. Oh, I know. Mr. Wright, how about I give you a copy of my invoice? What? I thought you weren't charging me. Oh, no, no, no. I mean the invoice for my perfume. Why would I need that? You are a lawyer, correct? Perhaps you can use it to sue that horrible post office for the emotional, agonizing, and distress I was put through today. Uh. Hey. That will teach them to put out more pens. 
Maybe part two. Right. He does that. <laughs> so no, I mean, like, uh, like. Tell me more two, about this perfume you ordered. Oh my gosh! It is simply to die for, Mister Wright. Or to die Though for when you smell it. Scent yet? It's a rare fragrance, after all. Like morning dew on a blooming rose. That's the slogan. Well, it's better than the slogan Maya thought up. And hey, you're I told you, you're it? just not putting enough just effort into saying it. I'm looking at the invoice here, and that's a lot of zeros for one bottle. Now I really hope this isn't an audio-only thing, because I just days. got through with one the most awesome is thing ever. For a year's worth of use. You want to wear perfume, Feeny? You know that's for girls, right? I guess I would go with that badge you have. You mean that? Yeah, that's my Equestria Attorney badge. Please tell me at least you think it looks as good as my hair in my suit. No. Compared to your suit and hair, <laughs> uh, the pink is too much, honestly. Even the citizens of this place can see this thing looks embarrassingly stupid. And no, Pinky, I didn't want to wear the perfume. I was just wondering why it's so darn expensive. Now look at that. Your suit is as good as new. Oh, wow. You really did a good job patching it up. I can't even see where you sewed it up. Please do take better care of your suit. It's called the Art of the Dress, Scott. Phoenix. But if you have art any more problems dress. with it, please don't hesitate to come to me. I would be more than happy to take on such a fine work of art again. Thank you. You really helped me out of a jam. This is my only suit I have while I'm here in Equestria, you see. That means you the haven't taken a shower. One? <gasps> Idea! How about I make you another one? Perhaps I can encrust the label with some rubies. Red and blue go well together, but topaz and amethyst might bring out the color in your eyes. Maybe some sunglasses would match the, dare I say, pizzazz of that hair of yours. Royal blue really is your color, but maybe we can give you a suit of a nice purple or lavender. As I said, purple is my favorite color, and I think it would look simply ravishing in it. Uh, she seems to have gone off on a tangent. Yeah, she goes off in her own world yeah, sometimes, buddy. Yeah, she'll probably be like this for about an hour or so. Ha! Oh, well. I don't know where we should go next, though. Fluttershy's Cottage. Fluttershy's Cottage? Why do you want to go there? I don't want to go there. The script says we go there to talk to someone, and then something strange happens. She did. <laughs> script? What script? Duh! The one the voice actors are following? Pinky, what on earth are you talking about? What voice actors? Like those people who do voices for characters in cartoons? far into it, since I don't like spoilers. You know, ruins the fun of the story. <laughs> what? You're completely going over my head. It says I should be going to Fluttershy's cottage, and that's where I'm going to go. You should come too, because it says you say, Why does she always run ahead of me like that? I better follow her, though. And follow me! See you there, Feeny! Pinkie Pie, wait! Why does she always run ahead of me like that? I better follow her, though. What? How did she do that? She's the true god of the show. They can only one they can break the fourth wall and bend it to her will. Reality itself cannot fabricate mm. the own dark matter and force things of Pinkie Pie. Why is it you wanted to come here again? You know what? I forgot. Perfect. So you just brought me here for no reason? Hey, you. Huh? Who are you? What tarnation do you think you're doing? No, 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 but if I, I hadn't, I guess that really doesn't represent anything when it comes to honesty, right but come on. I know that, but lying are still lying. It's what's called a white lie. The ones that are for good intentions. Mm. I'm sure Fluttershy doesn't appreciate your white lie. You know, like what yeah. you do. Look, I'm sorry I did that to her. It wasn't even really a lie. I just proposed the possibility, questioning Fluttershy's alibi. That's true. Alibi? Uh, stop trying to use your fancy silver tongue lawyer speak to confuse me. <laughs> In any case, Perfect. I'm gonna make everything right tomorrow. You're Apple Bloom's sister, right? Huh? How'd you know that? Take a wild guess, partner. Oh, oh right. The accent. Is it really that noticeable? Really? Hey, are you making fun of the way I speak? That's exactly what I was saying. No, He's like, of oh, not. that was horrible, but Phoenix. Who is this with you? Yep. Big Macintosh. Her brother. 
Oh, so you're siblings. <laughs> yep. yep. You better make everything right tomorrow. Or like I said, I'll knock you upside the head. <laughs> Don't worry. Me and Pinkie Pie have found some evidence that's definitely going to come in handy. Yep, that's right, Apple Jack. That reminds me. Why weren't you at the trial today, Pinkie Pie? Between you sure me and Rarity, I'm the only one who showed up. I slept in. That's it? That's it. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it. You gotta have a better excuse than that. Hey, at least she's honest, right? I an extra, extra bunch. <sighs> just we spoke with get. Rarity, and she kind of, uh, uh, got held up in traffic. That just goes to show you that Applejack is the most dependable pony there is. Right. Always say rain or shine. I mean, mm -hmm. got a trophy to prove it. Right, big man? That's rather <laughs> loyal of her. Trophy for being dependable? I knew I need to stop this, but come I on. I a trophy. I never even got one when I was in Little League. So I know you're Apple Bloom's elder sister, but I don't know anything about you besides that. Name's Applejack. Proud owner of Sweet Apple Acres. Sweet Apple Acres? Oh yeah. You're not from this neck of the woods, are you? It's an apple farm run by the Apple family, ten minutes due south from here. With a name like Applejack, I guess you were set up at birth to be put in that business. Yeah. I'm not here to talk That's about exactly that. That's exactly what thing. I was thinking about, I mean, Cutie Marks you know. By the name, you no, will get that cutie last mark. Time I saw her was and when by she was the name, you will be there. I know what Doing whatever that is. Oh, except when I was asleep. Then it was a general cake and Major You're Muffin. You're an exception. Major Muffin. I had a dream. <laughs> I was commanding a battalion of sweets fighting off an army of salad, asparagus, and broccoli. It was like nutrition versus sweets. I didn't know which side to enlist on at first, but I ended up going to the tasty side. It was a grueling war. Many gumdrops and chocolate chips lost their lives, but we triumphed in the end. I think I had a dream like that once. Croyd would have a field day with Pinkie Pie. So why are you looking for Apple Bloom? She's supposed to be serving her grounded. You know, after going in that forest so late. But that little troublemaker ran off as soon as she was excused from the trial. She was supposed to wait for me. By the way, I have to thank you, Phoenix Rat. Thank me? Weren't you just threatening to knock me upside the head just a minute ago? <laughs> yeah, I still want to do that. But I have to thank you for getting my little sister to tell the truth on that there stand. Yep. You sure have an extensive vocabulary there, Big Macintosh. He's a man of few words. I don't know if Twilight told you, but I represent the element of honesty, and I would like to see my kin follow suit, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I don't think element Twilight... Honesty? Yeah, Twilight didn't explain, like, yeah, the elements to him. laughter! It's like the best one ever! What's and the, the greatest. Do you want an element too, We can think of one for you! <laughs> the uh -huh. element of... Justice. Uh, sugar cube? Actually, that's actually pretty like good that. something. Hmm. Let's something. What element could you be? Oh, 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 I got it! Phoenix Wright, with his nifty do, represents the spirit of. Hair Gel! No comment. That one's also good. <laughs> Old Beardy came by the farm and told me in Big Mac element that he of saw Apple Bloom of Twilight. Or Fairness. Beardy? Oh, you must mean the judge. What's he doing wandering around this place? I wonder what Apple Bloom was doing with Twilight. Yeah, that's a good question. The last time I saw Twilight, she was as peeved as you were at me about that little incident in the courtroom. Except she oh, goes a little over over bit, overboard with that it. That is, if you honestly intend on setting things right. Right? Of course I'll set things right. <laughs> My name is Phoenix, right, after all. Stop! <laughs> that's not funny. That wasn't funny. Yeah, Feeny, you really need to have more variety. Yeah, a lot more. Am I the only one who thinks that joke is funny? Apparently. I may want to <laughs> knock you a new one, but I'll be rooting for you anyway. Your rainbow's only hope right now, and I hate to see her get banished. She doesn't deserve that. I know for a fact she didn't kill anyone. Oh, and no worries. matter what, what I'll I'm make doing, everyone see that if, truth. If it's not audio right now and extra show on camera, trust me, what I'd I'm like doing right now is very Jack. important. Shoot, partner. About Apple Bloom. Did she really arrive at home when she said she did? Yep, ten after nine. That's when she got home. She got a scolding from Big Mac and I for going into the forest so late. A scolding from him? Yes. And what did he do? Yupper into submission? Pretty much. Why do you ask? It's just that this second lightning bolt has been plaguing my mind. How is it both your sister and Fluttershy didn't hear or see it? I'm done with it, though. I was thinking that Ace Pegasus fella intercepted it before the thing it touched that the ground. But that makes one of your contrafiction again. doohickeys. Contrafiction? You mean contradiction. Contrafiction. Yeah, one of those. Couldn't hit him because of that suit. I was thinking the same thing. But according to Rainbow Dash, that suit makes you completely invulnerable to lightning while in the air. 
not to mention it would have made a sound and left a mark if it hit him on the ground where he was vulnerable. Mm-hmm. Uh, all this thinking makes my head hurt. I couldn't hold a match with the prosecution today, but things are going to be different now that I've had time to get a better grasp of the situation. That's how it works. Speaking of that, you got to show that stuck-up attention horse a thing or two for me. Attention horse? Attention You know, pony. that no-good blue snake in the grass. Hmm. What? Oh, you must mean Trixie. Of course, they yeah. meant Trixie, but uh, her. It's like, how She's a great she example do? of what Lion will lead to. She. Her fibbing and ponytails caused that big old Ursa to come a stomping through Ponyville. Actually, Twilight it was told me a bit about that. Who did it. I can't they were the dumb I ones who said, let's find a gigantic cosmic bear today. to cause havoc. I have noticed so Trixie has that effect on a lot of ponies in these do, parts. Do something she's about just it. doing this whole thing because she's all salty with rarity Twilight Rainbow and I. Wait a minute. I knew she had a grudge against Twilight, but why you and the other two? Last time Trixie was in Ponyville, she was showing off and bragging like she was the bee's knees. So the others and I called Trixie out on her hooey. Yeah. Turns out we were right. She was great and powerful after all. That's why I ended up proving it. More like, more like then, meek and I helpless. I told called Trixie out. <laughs> she gave her a hard time in the trial today. Oh, so you're responsible for that. Guilty as charged. Weak and powerless <laughs> Trixie. That was pretty entertaining. The weak watching and Trixie get verbally Trixie. served by a child. Certainly brightened up my day. I know, right? But isn't Trixie a performer? Isn't yes. she supposed to show off and blow things out of proportion? I don't think the decent and sort of powerful Trixie would really attract a crowd. Not defending her or anything, <laughs> as there were times I wanted to smack her upside the head. Trust me. You no, know, you don't understand. Remember how she was calling you Mr. Not Right today? It was like More that like Mr. Wrong. stage. Actually, she was calling me Mr. Wrong. You know, because it's the opposite of right and... Same difference. Same difference. The point is, it was just unbearable. I want you to do your best, Phoenix Wright. Show her what Ponyville is made of. Prove Rainbow was innocent and rubbing in that smug snot to show off face of hers. Yep. Deal. Let's shake on it. Okay. <laughs> well, go on. I'm not touching that hoof. Why not? Because there's spit all over it. And now he <laughs> turned into rarity! Man, Phoenix Wright, you're really? like a morpher. You've been turning at a lot of ponies with a lot of references. With a nod. Fine, uh -huh. man. I best be moseying on now, partner. Got to find that little fury. I'm going to go check Twilight's place. If you two see Apple Bloom, could you tell her to go on home? I don't want her running out and about with murders happening and all. Wow. She's with Twi, though, so I suppose I shouldn't be worried. Yeah, we'll be sure to if we see her. Thank you. Oh, don't mind me to give you a knock upside the head when I'm not <laughs> so busy. Later. <laughs> well, what a pleasant way to say goodbye to someone. By the way, later on, goodbye, I'm going to get Jack. you. So. Goodbye, Apple Goodbye, Goodbye. Big Macintosh. Yup. Yup. Was that the reason you wanted me to come here, Pinky? To speak with Applejack? I don't know if you guys saw that, but there was just like a weird line thing. I don't, I don't know if it was just on my end or it's on your end, too. Huh? What? <laughs> What's coming? I coughed. And? That means something strange is going to happen. Pinky Pie, I didn't, I didn't you've been hear, through this already. I didn't hear that one. You can't Pinky, predict things Pinky based sense. off of. What? What? What's okay. that? I've never seen one of those things before. That's a catchy tune. But that's impossible! Is awesome. How could someone be calling me? So, what do you do with that thing anyway? I guess I... Have I mentioned that Phoenix Wright has the best soundtrack? I don't think I did, don't but it does. Phone bill. Hello? Phoenix Wright? Yes, that's me. Who is this? A concerned friend. A concerned friend? A friend? Tell them I say hello! <laughs> Tell me! How and why are you phoning me? I want to help you. How? I want to help you win the trial tomorrow. I have some evidence for you that can clear your client indefinitely. Sounds like Cruz. What? Are you serious? Yes, I want you to meet me at the clearing. Where the crime took place. Yeah, it's All Cruz. Right. I'll be right there. Pinky, we have to- Alone. Huh? Oh, definitely Cruz. Be alone. There's no other way I can see you. Why? Why? I might get lost if I go in there alone. Do you want my help or not? Okay, okay, I'll go in alone. Look, Good. whenever someone I'll says, come at me alone, right that's like the main right. point where Tell you me, though, don't who go alone. Whatever you have to say to me, you can say I'll with my friends. Okay? Who are you talking to, Fiend? Especially to know he give you a good explanation not to have your someone friends around. Someone wants to meet me alone in the forest. Yeah, But he perfectly said he wanted said. to help me. How is he calling me anyway? Equestria doesn't seem to have cell phones. That's true. How, how do you do that? Pinky, I'm sorry, but I have to go solo here.
I just got a lead that could win me the Greek trial times. tomorrow. There are no phones. But whoever I was speaking to wants to meet me alone. That sounds kind of suspicious. Very suspicious. Wait, I know who that was. Really? Really? Yes, it was Wabniar, planning to do something nasty. <laughs> Pinky, there is no Wabniar. Besides, oh, I love that name. Male, and they said they wanted to help me. Oh, they did? <laughs> then that changes everything. All right, I'll wait for you by the entrance. I'll be right back out. The pathway more or less leads to that clearing, and the sun's still out. I shouldn't have trouble navigating myself through. Be mm. careful in there, Feeny. It's pretty dangerous. Yep. Okay. Timberwolves. I'll be and right back. Promise. Cross my heart and hope the flies take a cupcake in my eye. And let it burn, because taking a cupcake in your eye is not like the best thing to do ever. Hello? I'm here. Where is this mysterious friend of mine? He said he'd be waiting for me. You're about to get ambushed by one It's dude. me, Phoenix Wright. Maybe. You said you wanted to help me. Is this someone's idea of a prank? No, someone's hey, idea of an ambush. I know. I'll just hit the redial button on my phone. No doubt, huh? What? No connection point? Then how was he able to call me earlier? Because he's Wabinar. He's he like... Just interfering with the signal. I don't know. I, I don't know where I was going with that. Five more minutes. Then I'm leaving. This is getting creepy. <laughs> Phoenix, how many times have you been have you been knocked upside the head in your games? Cuz like the main one I always remember you was in the beginning of I think it was like oh my head. Trials and Tribulations? I, I forget which truck. game it was, but he did get knocked upside the head in the beginning of one of his games. Where am I? I'm still in the forest, but I'm then not he in the got and whatnot. Damn it! It was a trap! Now I'm lost! Phoenix! This is not get out of here. the place to say those words. How Such language. Even though the sun's still out, I can hardly see. Wait a minute. What? Where is it? All my evidence is gone! Ugh! Oh! Someone must have taken it while I was knocked out! Cruise control got all your stuff, but don't worry, Twilight's gonna stop him. Hello? Ah, Timberwolves! Oh, it's a good thing I saw the... Saw, uh, Family Appreciation Day before the game is, because then I wouldn't know what these things even were. Uh, nice puppies. Oh, man. I'm frozen in place. I'm too scared to move. Makes sense. They're going to attack me. You're going to die. No! Harry Potter came? Expecto Patronum? You should be ashamed of yourselves. Being a poor, innocent, defenseless Mr. Phoenix like that. Wow. Fluttershy? Fluttershy. You two are acting like a pair of big, mean bullies. What would your mothers think if they saw you behaving this way? <laughs> That's right, Timberwolves. I don't believe this. This can't be the same cowardly little pony. Now, I want the two of you to go My to cowardly little pony. I used to wonder what cowardness could be. My cowardly little pony. I'm done singing a song. Close, Mr. Phoenix. Mm -hmm. Those species of lupines are known to rip their prey apart within a few seconds. Lilip what? Water oh, so Thank they weren't. You, you saved my What's life. Forget it. Oh, you don't have to worry about that. Even if you had been killed, you would have come back to life in your ashes more magnificent than ever, right? You still believe he's a bird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fluttershy, listen. The reason I accused you earlier, I know you didn't do any of that garbage I was spouting. I just needed to buy another day to clear Rainbow Dash's name. Though I had good intentions, I did it at your expense without your say in the matter. Mm. I'm sorry I did that. Terribly. It's all right, Mr. Phoenix. I forgive you. Y you forgive me? Just like that? Just like that. Yes, I believe in you. That's why I came in here to look for you. Trust me, spontaneous sure forgiveness is You're like teen in this show. <laughs> but Fluttershy, what are you doing in here? I thought you were arrested. 
The police let me go. For good behavior. Yeah, very, very, no. very, very but good I behavior. You were suspect. I don't know why. They just said I didn't have to stay anymore and let me out. And that can only mean one thing. The feather didn't match any of her animals. When I got home, I saw Pinkie Pie standing by the entrance to the forest, and I asked her what she was doing. She said you went in here all alone. So I got worried, and I came in here to find you. Did you by any chance see anyone else in here while you were looking for me? No, I didn't. Uh, um, sh should I have seen someone? You know, like how I should have seen Apple Bloom that night? I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do something wrong again. Fluttershite's all it's right. It's funny how she right. just took on two savage wolves, and then she goes back into submissive wimp mode. <laughs> submissive wimp no, mode. No, it's okay. I'm gonna keep it's that just someone title me out and put me just in, in case I happen to get into it one of these days. Oh my, that's not very nice. On top of that, they stole all my evidence I was going to use to defend Rainbow Dash and the Technically he, tomorrow. but sure, um, sure, why not, they... But Twilight said she was going to defend Rainbow Dash tomorrow. Huh? What? She talked with me at the detention center earlier and told me to forget about you. Oh, no. I hope she's not doing what I think she is. And she was failed fire horribly. me for what I did to you. Trixie will eat her alive if she plans to defend Rainbow Dash. Are you talking about that blue unicorn in the wizard outfit? How could you forget yeah. Trixie, Fluttershy? I was barely holding my own against her. And I have experience. Wait, was... Twilight won't stand was a Fluttershy chance. there? Oh, I man, have to my get memory's her to reconsider. Sketchy. I'm sure if you tell her what you told me, she'll change her mind. I don't know. She was pretty bummed out. Then I'll help you explain it to her. Thanks, Fluttershy. Hey, wait a second. I just thought of something. So What is it, Mr. Phoenix? You said Pinkie Pie is standing by the entrance, right? Oh yeah, he's probably got... Oh, oh right. Yeah. I already saw that part. Well, whoever knocked me out would have to leave through the entrance, since that's the only way out. Oh, I see now. Since Pinkie Pie is waiting by the entrance... Pinkie Pie will probably see whoever attacked me exit the forest. I'll show you the way out. You were right about that this morning. Huh? Even if I may not like visiting it much, this forest really is like a backyard to me. Really? All right, lead the way. Ever free forest. This is where they meet Twilight and then like the everything that we already saw happens. Do I hear galloping? Galloping. It's not me. I can see that. It's getting closer. I can see some pony coming this way. What if it's who attacked me? The two wide, one really horned, blind, to fight a pony. Chaunting purple. Fluttershy. Death. Phoenix. Uh. Hey, yeah. Yep. Look, mm -hmm. I know you really must not like me after what I did today, but I can explain. Mr. Phoenix was only trying to help Twilight. Mm. He never meant to hurt anyone. Let's go back to the library. I don't think it's a good idea to stay in this forest. Yes. Yeah, I agree. Alright, so now we're back to where everything happens, and I pretty much know this whole entire part. Well... All the important bits, anyway. So that's why I did that. I know it wasn't fair to Fluttershy, but if I had just sat there and done nothing, Rainbow Dash would have been found guilty right there on the spot. Mm. I see. Do you still want to fire me? How did you- Fluttershy, Fluttershy told, me. told me. Look, I don't mind if you do, but I have to warn you, Trixie's one tough customer. I underestimated her. Despite all my experience, she managed to trump everything I threw at her. In fact, she could have easily overruled my feather theory. Not much I can say about this part since I already got all this out. What? Uh, I have a feeling the only reason she let me do that was to see another one of your friends in jail. She's gonna go all out tomorrow, so if you'd like to take over, I have to warn you about that. I don't know what I should do. If you really want to defend Rainbow Dash, at least allow me to do one more thing for you. You still want to help? Even though I was going to fire you? I'll yes. do all I can to help someone who's being accused of a crime they didn't commit. I know for a it's fact sort of a Rainbow thing. Dash didn't do anything wrong. And I know a certain pony who knows more than she's letting on. Mm -hmm. Actually, And we I actually know a lot more about her Phoenix, this time. Now I understand me, why you that said that. That thing you mixed in the evidence earlier, that wasn't a good luck charm, was it? Why do you ask? Let's just say I've been seeing a, seen lot, seen a lot, lot of locks, locks today. today. <laughs> locks and... Ugh, chains? See, I knew you knew! What was that thing, and what did it do to me? Uh, okay, I'll be honest. Because if I don't, I bet you'll see them around me. I'm listening. 
You see, it's called a magatama, a tool I use to see if people are hiding deep secrets. I really from me. wish that but actually don't get me wrong. in life. Right? I only use it when I'm investigating. Like, crime. I think, I think world deep peace secrets? would actually come if, if everyone had one of those secret, things, like embedded into their skull or something like that. The more locks, the deeper the secret. I wouldn't say world peace. Break those locks, I think life would be a little more interesting. Chances are the person, or in this case, the pony, will spill the beans. Mm. Interesting. And be a lot happier for some reason. Interesting. I thought you'd be mad. What about black ones? Black ones? What do you mean? I uh, already said there stuff were... about the black ones. Never mind. So, do you know how that thing's power got transferred into me? Not a clue. It probably had something to do with the way it reacted when you picked it up. Hmm. I'm actually kind of glad I saw I'm Twilight's sure first, because I had a bigger reaction I right when I saw the but black side locks on Trick Tree. Truth. I, I would have been like, wait, well, who, who did she black side locks You're on? You're not a very good liar, If I Twilight. saw this one first. I could clearly see that you bringing me here was no accident. Mm -hmm. You did it on purpose, didn't you? I'm that bad at lying, huh? Terrible! Yeah, you're about as thin as Kleenex. I mean, I love that identification line. spell? I know you have magic here and all, but that sounds like something a third grader came up with. I know that isn't a real spell. I was told not to say anything, but I suppose I owe you an explanation. Oh. Well, Princess actually, during this part, if it's not audio video. and this actually does work, so you know your name thing and I did. that badge prepared. Yeah, she did all that. Check it. I didn't know you were going to be from another world, though. Yeah, enjoy this picture That's as this goes bar. on. So I'm not the greatest defense attorney in the universe? Darn, I was starting to like that title. But how does she know me? I'm a bit sketchy on that detail as well. I too found it really odd how she Alright, hopefully it's not audio and you actually got a chance to see that. If not, I'm going to edit it in at the end. In your life before me. How does this princess character know me? I think I want to have a chat with your highness about this. Yes, I think you should. Well, I I'm a little interested. Like the fact that I was being deceived My only guess is she actually bought a Nintendo for telling me the truth. and played all your games. I apologize. I was just doing what the princess told me to. She seems genuinely sorry about it. I shouldn't hold it against her. Perhaps I should just change the subject. Yes. Hmm. So this evidence you found. Seems he had a good turnout. Oh. Mm. Ah! What's the matter? The other half of the letter! The other half of the letter? Wait, you have it? Wow, that's yeah, a Yeah, I found it with Pinkie Pie today. This is my letter stating my permanent leave of absence. After the Equestria 500 is over, I can no longer work with you. We made quite the team, but I can't live with the guilt any longer. I can't keep helping you ruin others' lives. It saddens me beyond belief that we must part ways. So it's obviously that Goodbye, Mia look-alike pony. In the future. Sonata. Someone was so it's obviously Sonata's yeah, little resignation. Yeah, and I think I know who. She even who? Said it, so. I'll tell you once I confirm my suspicion. Mm. You said you had someone you wanted to talk to, right? Perhaps we should go our separate ways again. You're right. Come back here once you're done, though. You were attacked, after all. You have my word. Okay, now we get to see more about what Phoenix did afterwards, instead of what Twilight did afterwards. Hey and say hotel. Okay, so we're going back to Sonata. Hello, Sonata. Hello? Hello, Sonata. Oh. What do you want? I just wanted to talk, that's all. I already spoke to you. Can you please leave? No. You should be grateful I didn't tell the police about you and your friend's intrusion today. That's also Funny a fact. Funny you say that, because I was wondering why you didn't. If you had me arrested, there would be no defense attorney tomorrow, meaning Rainbow Dash would be most likely found guilty. In other words, exactly what you want. Hmm. Ooh, gotcha. Shots fired. I'm not here about Whatever. that, though. I just wanted to talk to you about a question you were avoiding earlier. What was it like being Ace's manager? Take that! Take that! Well, let Makatama go along. A question like that is none of your business. Now, let's, let's see what, what you're, you're hiding, hiding, Sonata. <laughs> By the sound of it, it seems it wasn't good at all. I, I can't believe this! Shouldn't you be investigating the crime? Why are you bothering me with your annoying questions? Because you got, like, because four red, red locks around your body. Really? Me? Tell me, Mr. Wright, why do you think I'm involved with this crime? I'll show you why, Sonata. Take that! This look familiar to you? <laughs> Where did you get that? Seems someone who was working with Ace was planning on quitting after the race. 
And I think that someone is you, Sonata. You're the only one working with Ace in Ponyville at the moment. Yes. Yeah. That's one broken. Hmm. You think I wrote this? Yes, you I've did. I've never seen this letter before. For all you know, it could have been mailed here by Ace's butler. No, I don't think you wrote this. I know you wrote this. Why? Can explain how? Because this half was in your... You see, it's very simple, actually. Dang. We can just compare the writing to something I know for a fact you did write. And I have it right here. Take that! This unicorn spellbook I found in this very room. Are you saying I wrote this book? Yes! Of no, course more not. like the footnote. But this book has some interesting characteristics. I can't read a single word of it. Then why are you showing it to me? It probably belongs to the hotel. No, it, no, it doesn't, doesn't belong to the hotel. I know a unicorn who reads a book just like this. Mm. And says it's only available in Canterlot. Now he remembers the name. From. <sighs> Whatever. It's my book. What exactly are you trying to prove here? Like I said, I can't read any of the characters written inside these pages. Except these ones. Ah! Continue from here. I can read that note scribbled on the page. You couldn't find a bookmark, could you, Sonata? Hmm. I'm sure if we compare the writing in here to that letter, we'll get a perfect match. Yes. Ugh. Fine! I wrote the letter! Broken. But you still fail to prove any relevance to this. You'll see. Mm -hmm. You'll so see. what? I was going to quit. Why do you think I have something to do with this? I can't help ruin others' lives. I wonder what that could mean. <laughs> I won't play dumb, because I know exactly what this little statement means. Take that! Is this some kind of joke? Why are you showing me these pictures? I found out earlier today, from my client, Ace was doing something very wrong to her. And I think you know all too well what it was. You were in on this blackmailing business, weren't you? It fits perfectly with the context of your resignation letter. Yep. <sighs> oh, one more. <laughs> you certainly have a wild imagination, Mr. Wright. Blackmail? Really? Even if your client was being blackmailed, what makes you think Ace and I were behind it? I know it's the truth, Sonata. Is that so? I don't see anything mentioning blackmail on this letter of mine. And those pictures of my client? Maybe Ace just needed a good laugh at his competition to get in the right mindset. Really? I, I don't, don't know anyone so. else in the world that Ruin actually others would ever do that. kind of fits the description of blackmail. Yes. It could mean anything. You have no proof Ace and I were blackmailing any pony. Actually, uh, I do. <laughs> How? We just have to use this. Take that! That? This is the letter Rainbow Dash was blackmailed with. Demands right from the horse's mouth. Like I said, there is no way you can prove Ace or I wrote this. It doesn't even have a name on it. Really? I don't need a name. There's an easier way to find out who wrote this. W what? Just like earlier, let's compare the writing style on this blackmail letter to your letter of resignation. They seem to match up perfectly, Sonata. Hmm. Would you have any idea why? Quite. There's also that list I found on your table. With 835 next to Rainbow Dash's name, the same time requested to meet her on this letter. Well done, Mr. Wright. I guess there is no way to deny it anymore. As I said, it's just like come full circle once all of them are gone. I love it. I love it. That's the point. Uh. Problem? You're supposed to keep Shouldn't talking. You be worried? Worried? <laughs> Whatever should I be worried about? I found you out. You were blackmailing my client. That's a crime, Miss Cold Hard Swift Justice. Wow. Do you remember what I said earlier? My talent. My eye for detail. It's what I've been using the whole time Ace and I have been doing this. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just started to think about something. For it's example, really hilarious. The days I studied Miss Rainbow Dash, I could <laughs> see that she had quite an ego and reputation. I'm sorry. That's why I took those photographs of her. We had quite the lucrative business set up, Ace and I. We have several gamblers placing large sums of money on him after we have yeah. our way with a potentially tough competition, then split the money 50-50 on top of what he's awarded for winning. 
That's why your client was targeted. Her performance at the Cloudsdale Young Flyers competition. Sonic Rainbow. Why are you telling me all this? To prove that I'm not worried at all. You see, I can get anyone to keep their mouth shut once I find out what makes them tick. You're no exception. W what? Mr. Wright, I'm not worried in the slightest because you're not going to tell a soul about this. And why would you're I? You're wrong. I'm going to tell the police about this right away. With my conversations with you, I can tell you hold your loyalty and your client in high regard. All the time. So what? You can't take that away from me. Yeah. Or can I? Just tell me. If I so much as even catch wind of you uttering the word blackmail to What anybody, about purple mail? I'll report what or you and your little accomplice white mail? Or what about... She must mean how I broke into her hotel room. Yin What about You'll yin mail? You'll find it a little hard defending your client yin mail? in prison cell. Because... <sighs> you had no white. jurisdiction to search in my it. hotel room, and you and that pink pony left prints all over the place. I have more than enough evidence to take you down with me. It would be troublesome if information regarding my dealings got out, and you want to defend your client, correct? Yes. Seems we're at a stalemate. Why didn't you just report Seems me earlier? Seems that we're at an impasse Simple. now. Then let's I go then. I held the cards till I knew I could use them to my advantage, which I am right now. So, do we have a deal, Mr. Wright? I can't get that I'll image out of my head. I'll take your silence as yes. Don't worry. I'll be at the trial tomorrow to make sure you keep our little secret to yourself. Goodbye, Mr. Wright. Please go away and don't come back. Oh, I knocked on her door just to spite her. Looks like I ended up on the same boat as all her other victims. Mm. <sighs> what do I do? Though this seems important, how does it fit in with anything? Easy, she could be a third party. As in she was, i.e. she was with Ace. During and seems I don't know. <laughs> Better not tell her about Sonata. Because I had to die there. somehow. Not only for my sake, but for hers as well. Hi, Aloysius. Hey, an owl. <laughs> you. You're an owl. Come on, Phoenix. Ooh. Not you. You mean who am I? Phoenix Wright, with a PH and a W. Really? Ooh. You know, you make Big Macintosh look like a blabbermouth. Ooh, Big Macintosh. <laughs> Finally gets to meet Spike. Okay, good. You're Spike, right? I remember meeting you earlier. When I heard he was a dragon, I thought he'd be much bigger. But he's just a little guy. Yeah. Yeah, I remember. You were being a big drama queen this morning. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. Getting one hour of sleep will do that to you. So what's this owl doing here? That's Owlicious. He helps Twilight with her late night study sessions since he's nocturnal. Aloysius, huh? I, I think you, Aloysius you're episode Aloysius. is underrated. Because it's not Sometimes they keep bad. Sometimes I keep adding people say what, why, it's just not, you where, know, or how. So you're it, Twilight it, It's like narrator said, it's just yep. been overshadowed. Number one assistant Spike. It's like having a new oh, so IP come out when the new Mario and Grand Theft Auto the name game comes in. Assistant? And hey, and, I mean, and, that's and still Halo. number one. Sort of. Who cares about it's this new guy when all the other old guys come in? A little better on me. Better, to say better. Me. Who? Stop! Me, Spike! You know my name! I, I, I'm gonna have a feeling... You're not gonna win. Twilight wasn't I wonder lying. how many times they're gonna do that mean. joke whenever she I wish it's like involved. It's like a bookworm's dream come true. Yeah. <laughs> Twilight's a total nerd. Ah. Excuse me? Oh, you're back, Twilight! I, um... So that's what happened. I was just yeah. on my way to, uh... Um, that face. Organize those... Awesome books my intelligent and smart friend reads! Again, nice rebound, Spike. Uh, later! Did you find out what you needed to know? Yes, I'll fill you in about it tomorrow. I have a good idea who's behind all this. Okay. Wait, so you're not firing me? Sorry. I thought about it, and I realize now that you mean well. And if what you say is true, you stand a better chance against Trixie than I do. Way better. Please, just tell me when you're going to do something like you did today. Yeah, I will. I shouldn't need to do anything like that again. From here on out, I'll try to find out what really happened in that forest that night. Mm -hmm. Fluttershy forgave you, so I guess I can too. The princess also said I can trust you. I'll try. No. I won't let you down this time. That's good. Thank you. That's good.
That spare bed is in the same place. Try to get lots of sleep this time. I'm pretty tired after all that's happened today. Investigating sure takes a lot out of you. Tell me about Should. it. I think I'm going to bed early. All right. I'm probably going to crash soon as well. Good night. This whole situation with Sonata is bugging me. Not only her blackmailing, but her appearance. Is it only a coincidence she looks like her? Or is that somehow really Mia? How, why would you think that? May know who's like a reincarnation? Mind. Perhaps I should just wait until tomorrow instead of stressing my brain about this. Hi, Aloysius. Wait a minute. Hey, Aloysius. Do you think you could do me a favor? Mm. Ooh. Do me a favor. You know, me. To be continued. Alright, I can have a good stopping point right here then. Now, uh, as my grandmother is now currently in the background, I am going to start my review on this. Again, this was all in Phoenix Wright point of view, and we got to learn a lot more in a new suspect. Maybe it's not Cruise Control and Lenora, or probably it is them, and uh, the third party is uh, Sonata. Sonata is a very spitting image of uh, Mia, for some reason, and Phoenix Wright is a little bit in denial on that. I don't know why. But, um, one thing to know about this, uh, maybe I should have seen this one first, maybe I shouldn't, either or, I got all the information now, and I'm ready for what seems to be the final part, at least that's what my friend told me, of part four. Okay, what to expect? I expect this to be an extremely long episode, and I also expect it to be really awesome. So... Without further ado, ado, oh, yeah, let, by the way, just, just need to show that picture one more time. I know, like, I, I can already say that, uh, like, one or two of you are just gonna, like, go online, go on Google, search up Marshmallow Rarity, and post it up and let me see it, because I know somewhere I already did this. I know somewhere I already did that. So, yeah, uh, I'll see you guys next time, and...